Jump by shout manager Stephen Bell that's today's win against one well there's always a good time to score and it's in injury time. Yeah no we were you know we deserve that today. I thought we were really good second half. Well first half they bossed it. Um, we didn't seem to, you know, we were speaking to them, you know, all week about they've got to be up for this. This is like a local derby in a sense. You know, you know what Mungwell are, they're a really, really good team. Um, and the Texan on beating and they were bang at it today. But um, I thought our quality told in and obviously they've had a man sent off. We went down to 10 first off with Simbin with Kieran. Uh, but no, we are, I'm, I'm made up because we have been to some teams, you know, there's a number of games where we've dropped points this year and we've absolutely bossed it and we've just not been able to score. So to get to today, it's sort of like last 15, 20 minutes, whatever it were, uh, were just rewards really for, for lads' hard work and, and, and sticking at it. Um, when they could have got their heads down at first half, coming in at 1 0 down in a big game, so now I'm made up. And we weren't even at as best today, to be fair. Um, we were, you know, decent second half, but even then, you know, quality, what we normally have, probably um, missed us a little bit, but work rate, desire, will to win, you know, sticking at it, you know, outstanding, you know, so I'm made up. Do you think it was going to be another one of those days when we hit the post twice within a minute of each other? Well, I think it was three times winning it. I think um, um, Kier, uh, Nats hit it, uh, Kimbo's hit it, Kieran's hit bar. Um, and I, to be fair, I, I, did, I did think, I said, like, you know, not, not again. Um, just can't be today. So, you know, made up. I think goals, you know, probably a deflection on one. Um, so, you know, it's about time that something like that fell for us. So, uh, yeah, made up. Lads stuck at it, and that's desire. You've got to be a winner. Like you know, there's some good teams at the top of this league. There's going to be you know maybe one or two good sides that miss out on playoffs, and we want to make sure we're in a good position. We play more games than everybody else, but you know we've got the quality. We don't fear anybody, but we've just got to win games week in, week out, and uh, we can't afford to drop points. And today puts us in another good spot and sends a message to the rest of the league that you know we can be um, bang at it against you know so-called physical um, teams with high intensity. So uh, yeah, I'm made up. And uh, as you say, they went down to ten men in the first half. How do you think that affected the game? Yeah, I know. I thought they were good. They, they, you know, they loaded it. I thought they defended well. I think their centre half's different class. They've got two, three lads up front that work the socks off. They make it difficult. They're an odd team to play. They remind me a little bit of Albury. Uh, you know, they've got a plan. They stick to it. Um, they're physical. They're strong. They just work the socks off. Um, and sometimes, just because we've, I would say we've probably got a little bit more talent than them, but that means nothing if if our lads aren't prepared to win battles. So, yeah, no, it did change it a little bit. But as did us going down to ten men in first half for a Simbi. You know, what I mean, I thought we started to take control actually when we went to ten men, and it, it were a clear red, um, clear second yellow. So um, you know, there can't be any complaints on their side. I want to thought. Um, but yeah, it did change it. But the sat in, and it probably made it a little bit difficult for us because the, the, the sat in, um, they're hard to break down. Um, and maybe we 11 men that are, you know, that are pushed on and would have found a few more gaps and some of our lads you know, higher up the pitch would have found a few more pockets of space and um, caused damage. So, don't always go for you, but um, yeah, end of day, look, 2-1. Um, and, and what I would like to say is that that felt like the Shadbrook of old when I used to come down here and play or play for him or play for us or play against where it were like fans were bang at it, they were loud um, and that's what we need. So, we need you to turn up, have a word with your mates, have a word with your family, get them down here because we need them. And now we move on to uh, next Saturday, another difficult game. Yeah, you know, they cause us problems. They let us play when we played them here. Um, they let us have first half, they did probably lay a glove on us. And then second half, they put it on us and we find it difficult. So, you know, it's a, a bit of travel as well. So we've got to make sure that we get there in plenty of time to, to make sure that we're fresh for kickoff. And we can't allow it to be that we've put a load of effort into this and then drop points again next week. We've just got to keep banging the drum. Um, every game's hard at, at, this, at this league and, um, you know, our lads have got to be up for it and I'm sure they will be. Oh,